Okay, so Fog of War. Fog of War is actually very, very easy to implement uh, in a map. All you need to do is go to Map, Fog of War, click Fog of War, and now Fog of War is enabled. You notice this isn't a, a true black Fog of War, uh, but if we go to View as shows player, they can't see anything. Uh, so that just makes it a little easier as a GM to use a, a lighter color uh, when you're uh, running the campaign. Uh, so the other thing that we're going to talk about here is going to be our uh, vision. So to enable vision, you need to either set it to daytime or nighttime. So we'll set it to nighttime so that we can also play with lights again uh, like we did previously. So we'll set it to night. Um, and what we're going to do, oops, uh, highlighting there. So what I'm going to do is uh, going to bring in uh, a player character now. I'm going to go back to my initial map. Oops, no. No, we can just deal with this guy from topology. So what we're going to do is copy, uh, control C, and then we're going to go to uh, hopefully the right map here. Uh, and uh, what we're going to do is then is, uh, let's take a look at the other one. Yeah, so that one's not in the right map. Okay, so now that we're in the right map, what we're going to do is press control V. Um, and then what we're going to do is click on this guy. We're going to hit Control P. Now I'll move them with the square, this will help things out. Uh, and we'll hit Control P. Uh, and now what you, can, you can see where he's been. Uh, so let's say he moves forward a square. He's being cautious. Okay, still moves forward a square. Control P. Control P. Eventually we'll run into the, the uh, building here somewhere. Uh, control P. Okay. And what we're going to do is, once he gets up the building, say he lights a... Um, okay, now he's in the building entrance for you. So somewhere he finds a light, so we're going to give him a, a bigger light source here so we can do more with map. So we're going to do clear all for the light source. Uh, oops. And then we're going to give him a bigger light source here. Uh, we'll do bright. Uh, we'll give him a sunrod. Uh, and then we'll do... US player. We'll do control P. Alright, now we can see more of the map because he let's say he found a sunrod. So now he's gonna walk up to here. And oops, sorry, over to here. Uh, and this is the doorway, so now we can see in through the doorway and you can see a little bit of our map. Um, now what I'm gonna do actually is turn off fog of war for a moment. And then we're gonna go to player view, and you'll see he can't see uh, as outlined by that yellow, the light gray, uh, he can't see past uh, these walls. So if I was, let's say move him over to here, um, he can't see around the corner because of the the uh, presence of the wall there. And so that is pretty much all you need to do to set up vision. Um, and again, just for kicks, let's uh, go back to our grasslands map real quick. And let's grab another guy, grab this guy, doesn't matter who. And we'll go back here, uh, and we'll go hit control, oops, sorry, control V. Um, and we'll give him a light source as well so that he can see. Otherwise it causes all kinds of problems. Uh, so we'll give him the sun round as well. So now you can see, he can't see his buddy. He can't really, see, he can see his buddy a little bit, but uh, move him over. So again, that's really all that you need to do to set up vision and light uh, in your campaigns. So I hope that helps, and take care.